The U.S. Army has used local television stations in the U.S. as training posts for some of its psychological operations personnel, according to Yahoo News blog The Upshot. Since at least 2001, both WRAL, a CBS affiliate in Raleigh, North Carolina, and WTOC, a CBS affiliate in Savannah, Georgia, have regularly hosted active duty soldiers from the Army's 4th Psychological Operations Group as part of the Army's Training with Industry program. Training with Industry is designed to offer career soldiers a chance to pick up skills through internships and fellowships with private businesses. The PSYOP soldiers use WRAL and WTOC to learn broadcasting and communications expertise that they could apply in their mission, as the Army describes it, of, quote, influencing the emotions, motives, objective reasoning, and ultimately the behavior of foreign audiences. WRAL and WTOC were on a list of participants in the Army's Training with Industry program provided to the upshot in response to a Freedom of Information Act request. And a spokeswoman with the Army's Human Resources Command confirmed that PSYOP soldiers worked at the stations. Lieutenant Colonel Stacy Bathrick said, quote, Both of these stations are very supportive of the military and think very highly of the program. Bathrick said the soldiers were never involved in news gathering. The relationship between PSYOPs, training with industry, and television news operations has stirred controversy in the past. In 2000, after a Dutch newspaper reported that PSYOPs troops had been placed in CNN's newsroom under the program, CNN discontinued the internships and admitted that they had made a mistake. A spokesperson said at the time, quote, It was inappropriate for PSYOPs personnel to be at CNN. They are not here now, and they never again will be at CNN. WRAL and WTOC are not alone among media outlets that the U.S. military has sought to learn from through training with industry. The upshot has previously reported that the Marine Corps placed public affairs officers with the Chicago Tribune for several years in order to better understand how to influence and work with the news media. And CNNMoney.com hosted an officer in 2007 and 2008 despite the network's embarrassment over the program in 2000.